report in Atlanta, Georgia, the AJC, the Atlanta Journal-Constitution, now giving word what the judge has decided. Apparently, Fonnie Willis can decide for her own if she wants to stay or leave the case and take Nathan Wade with her. Lucas Media says, you just heard, it's actually from Fox News, uh, the judge dropped some of, believe, six of Trump's charges that Fonnie had charged against him. And I knew that this was going to probably happen where he's trying to rule for both in favor of both parties. Fonnie can stay on the case, but she got to drop Nathan Wade. Now, I know a lot of people have been making content. Shout out to everybody. Uh, Real Data Network, lead attorney, Nate the lawyer. I've been following all those, uh, that system, those brothers on it. It's been great entertainment. I'm not even going to sit here and lie. I didn't think he was going to disqualify her, but I did figure he was going to try to figure out a way to work this out. I mean, fine. You got to let the man go. I'm sorry. I think that's fair. You should not be able to mess with somebody and then have them be the prosecutor and you still paying them. And then there's no real paper trail. You pay cash and, you know, so it's a win win for both. She stay on the case and Trump now won't have Nathan Wade on his going against him or finally can can ride with nate nathan and um step down so we'll see what happens i do think that fine is going to just keep going at trump because now it, it, it became real personal and like i said in the very first video i made about this finally you should have had every all your ducks in a row because when you go after one of the most powerful people on the planet they are going to dig up anything they can find on you even if you didn't get removed it was still a smear campaign so you know you gotta be careful out here like yeah you can go after uh young thug and uh yfn uh, lucy lucy is that how y'all say it you can go after all those rappers didn't she try to get dirk and von jammed up you can go after people like that but when you start going after people who had nuclear footballs and can hire and fire the um, attorney general and you know they at the top of the chain you don't think that their supporters and donors are going to figure out okay you charging him what, what can we do to get those to get you removed even though she didn't technically get removed he still got multiple charges dropped against him and that was their whole agenda you know, Trump can raise 30 million to go after you. So you got to be careful next time. But it's all good. You know, should be all right. I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. What y'all think?